Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, we will discuss about the recurrence relation and types of recurrence relation. So, a recurrence relation is a mathematical expression that defines a sequence in terms of its previous terms. So, it is a mathematical expression which defines a sequence of terms in the previous terms, sequence in terms in the previous terms. For example, uh, Fibonacci series, factorial. So, these are the examples of the recurrence relation. Towers of Hanai problem, these are the examples. An algorithm is recursive if it can call itself. Recursive algorithms generally solve a problem by reducing the problem to an instance of the same problem with smaller input. Often times, a recursive solution to a problem is the most natural and therefore gives the simplest procedure. So here, f is a function that defines relationship between current term and previous terms. A recurrence relation is a way of describing how complexity of an algorithm grows with increasing input size. So if you are increasing the size, uh, the input size of the algorithm, so the algorithm will be, will be very will, will be become very complex. So types of recurrence relation: substitution method, recursion tree method, and master's theorem. So first we will see the substitution method. So in the substitution method, we, see, we will simply make a guess for the solution and then we use mathematical induction to prove the guess is correct or incorrect. So let us consider an example here. So this is the example t of n equals to 2 t of root n plus log n. Okay. So we are going to simplify it by letting m equals to log n. So m equals to, so let m equals to log n, that means, so if you get go this side, n equals to 2 power n. So now, so substitute this one in the first equation, right. So t of 2 power m equals to 2 t of 2 power m by 2 plus m. So we will rename s of m equals to t of 2 power m. So we consider the 2 power m as s of m. So now s of m equals to t of 2 power m. Okay. So now we will substitute the s of m here. So s of m equals to This is equation 2. So substitute the here. So s of m equals to 2 s of m by 2 plus m. Okay. So that equals to big O of m log m. So changing back from s of m to t of n, we obtain, okay, so t of n equals to t of 2 power m. So here given, right, so this one, okay. That equals to s of m. So t of 2 power m equals to s of m. That equals to big O of m log m. That equals to big O of log n n uh, log log n. So this is the time complexity here. T of n equals to big O of log n log log n. Actually, this question is asked in the Eugenet examination. Okay. So, we can solve the same recurrence relation using different methods that is substitution method or recursion tree method or master's theorem. Okay. So, this is about the substitution method. In the next video, we will learn about the recursion tree method in detail. Thanks for watching the video.